Guna, it's good to see a face I trust. Even your frightful mug. I thought this could be your shared saga, but it is time to leave. We have spent not but a drink together. Worry not, Eivor. You and I have many tales to tell yet. And our names ring out clear and with honor. Yeah, a tale. A tale of Gloucester. Beautiful land, full of damned fools. Ha! I will drink to that. You have my thanks. Anything for you, old friend. Then let us say our farewells to this wicker king. And then be on our way home. Yes. Ranvi will be eager to meet Bridget. Bridget and Gunnar have already gone ahead. I should join them. The burning of the Harvest King. It is a momentous occasion for many here. Like the Christ, he sacrifices himself for his people. So that they may prosper. But this is an empty platter for your gods. Hungry bellies are known to retaliate. None can take Kunon's place. And to put his corpse in the pyre would be an insult. Christ turns his eyes from this ritual. But you condone it. I am to be Tevda of a united land. I can no longer turn my eye from anything. Tradition dictates the burning be overseen by the High Priestess. Modron is missed here. My hand has hindered this blow twice, then. Then I will oversee, as is my right, my blood. I took Mothran from you. You have every right to feud with my line. One you old enough to hold a sword. Mother saw your fate. The future will punish you greater than I ever could. Punishment or not, you will go into the future as Gloucestershire's ally. And someone I will never forget. Let the flame be set. May the crop be abundant. Eivor, the honor is yours. Praise the harvest, King! Bloody pagans! Now it seems the wind calls me back to Ranji. Let's tell.